This is Paul at PF Engineering with an update on the dump trailer. It's been uh, almost two years now. Uh, it's been going well. And I've installed a standalone hydraulic unit on it so I don't have to plug it into my tractor. Uh, it was doing okay that way, but uh, a little slow. So uh, I'm going to demonstrate that. I'm going to pull the tailgate. Uh, we have over a, a yard of three-quarter stone. That's over 3,000 pounds. Uh, and after it's dumped, I'll show you some of the workings. Okay, well, let's go. So as you can see, that was uh, quite a bit faster than using the tractor hydraulics. So let's just take a look at what we've got. This is a four and a half horse Honda vertical shaft that is running a three to six gallon per minute gear pump. And we have control valve. There's the uh, filter and the reservoir right here. The breather is actually this, this section of square tubing. And underneath, I think you can see it, we have the shutoff that I always like to use with a magnetic drain plug just to catch whatever. So, who doesn't have a vertical shaft lawnmower engine kicking around that they can use? Uh, and this is quite a bit more versatile than an electric over hydraulic unit because uh, this happens to have a power beyond plug where you can run anything else you might want to. In addition to these quick connects where you can plug stuff in. So, the uh, design of this is a hybrid scissors lift and uh, it's been working well the tractor is a, a John Deere 317 it pulls it just fine uh, tongue weight's not an issue so if you've got say a machine that doesn't have hydraulics uh, ATV quad side by side whatever pull it around um, dump whatever you want wherever you want so that's the update on the dump trailer here. It's going over two, about two years now, and uh, I'm very happy with it. Uh, the plans that I sell for this have included the hydraulic power pack uh, from day one. So I decided to follow my own instructions and build the thing and test it out. Of course, it works pretty well. So. And the trailer itself has been holding up okay. I've been using it for all kinds of things around the yard. So that's the update. Thanks for watching.